Did you know that the Skyzone Sky04X has a built-in drone locator feature? In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use these goggles to locate a lost drone. Now this feature is gonna work on the O4X as well as the Skyzone Cobra X, Eosheen EV300O, and other similar goggles. It uses the analog module on the goggles to locate the video signal from the drone. So it only works for analog FPV. It's not gonna work with any digital systems. And it also requires that the drone still be powered up and still have a battery connected to it. You might say that it's good for finding hot single drones in your area. Now to use this feature, you first need to make sure you remove any Omni antennas from your module and make sure that you do have a patch antenna connected to the module. You need that patch antenna because it's directional and that's how this feature works. It needs that to zero in on the signal. Once you've done that, make sure these goggles are powered up and in the normal RF mode that you'd use for analog video. And then to enable the feature, the only thing you need to do is hold down on this left scroll wheel for a few seconds. And once you hear it start beeping, that lets you know that the feature is enabled. And so from here, we can go ahead and start trying to locate the drone. Let me show you how this works. Now you probably don't wanna wear the goggles while you're doing this because you can't see anything on the screen anyway. And if you're not careful, you know, you might, uh, you might fall or you might, you might trip on something. So don't wear the goggles. But it is really important to watch where you're pointing the goggles because the way this feature works is you're gonna watch for the beeping to change as you point the goggles in different directions. And you wanna follow the beeping as it gets faster. Now, if you're just walking around casually, swinging the goggles wherever, it's not gonna work very well because you're not gonna know which direction you should walk in. So let me give you a little bit of a pro tip. Take the goggles and just brace them against your stomach, just like this. And that way, as you turn, you're always gonna be pointing in the same direction as the patch antenna. And so you'll know exactly which way to go. This also looks really cool and it's a good workout. You know, it kind of opens up the hips a little bit. So I definitely recommend this approach. I know that's the kind of tip that you guys look for when you follow this channel, that kind of pro advice. Let's go ahead and continue. So as you walk, you're gonna listen to the beeping and what you wanna do is follow the beeping as it gets faster. That's gonna let you know that you're getting closer to the drone. As the beeping changes, that means that the module is starting to get a stronger signal and so you can kind of move the goggles in different directions and wait for that beeping to change and just follow the faster beeping. Now that beeping is going to get faster and faster and you know eventually it's not even going to change as you move the goggles around. And once it's at that point, that lets you know that you're probably pretty close to the drone. So it makes sense to go ahead and turn off the drone locator feature. To do that, all you have to do is hold down again on that left scroll wheel for a few seconds, and that's gonna disable the drone locator. Now at this point, you can just look around your immediate area. It's probably within a few feet of you, and hopefully you'll be able to find your drone. Now, where is it? There you are. Oh, come on, Nick Burns again? That's the third time this week. 